so children welcome to video 2 now and uh, you see we are discussing electricity we had gone till charges now let us try to understand we have got a potential we have got a positive field over here say for example there is a body kept over which is positively which is heavily positively charged all right and then what happens uh, i take up a, a, another object say for example i bring this it has got a unit positive charge one coulomb of charge i told you how a body can become one can carry one coulomb of charge so unit positive charge now when i am bringing it towards point a, i have to do work to bring one coulomb of charge say for example i did 10 joules of work then the potential at this point will be said to be 10 volts so the unit of potential is 10 volts you have to understand this it the other way if i say if the potential of point a is 10 volts what do you mean by this then you can simply say if i bring one coulomb of charge from infinity till a i will have to do 10 joules of work against the electric field see it is the amount of work done to bring unit positive charge from infinity to the concern point you have to add over here against an electric field we take positive field as reference it's just by convention and we talk about electricity so this you have understood so now how much is the work done to bring 5 coulombs of charge to a point at potential 25 volts now suppose i change this and the potential is 25 volt that means to bring one coulomb of charge i have done how much work 25 joules so to bring five coulomb of charges how much of work i do so what i do now i have been given the exact potential of point a is 25 volt now that means to what does potential at point a is 25 volt means that to bring one coulomb of charge from infinity to point a we have done 25 joules of work so the potential is 25 so to bring 5 coulomb char of charge if i bring one coulomb i do 25 uh, joules so if i bring five coulombs i do 25 into 5 joules so obviously the work done will be here as electrical work done we can say is equal to 5 into 25 that is 125 joules so that means we can get an equation work done is equal to potential into charge in coulombs i'll write this way work done is equal to work done is equal to potential into charge in coulombs in c c means coulomb so w is equal to v into how do we denote charge q so w is equal to vq electrical work done is equal to potential into charge in coulomb similarly now what happens suppose i'm bringing bringing this charge over here and okay and now suppose from infinity i bring about one coulomb of charge till a we do 25 joules of work so potential here is 25 <coughs> if i take it from here from infinity to point b further closer i will have to do extra work so it is 45 volts so now 45 volts what does this mean from here to here if i have to transfer a one coulomb of positive charge from a to b i have to do 20 joules of work see the difference 45 minus 25 is 20 so 20 joule 20 joule is the work done to bring unit positive charge from a to b that is the potential difference between a and b so what is potential difference between two points it is the amount of work done to bring unit positive charge from one point to another point against an electric field so here the pd is 20 volts now again the same question can be asked how much is the work done to transfer five coulombs of charge between two points having potential difference of 20 volts so work done straight away potential difference into charge in coulombs delta means difference so potential difference will be how much 20 over there and charge is how much 5 that means we do 100 joules of work also try to un understand what is the unit of work done it's joule what is the unit of potential volt joule by volt is equal to coulombs or in other words there is one unit of potential which is volt another another unit of potential or potential difference can be v is equal to w by q that means joule per coulomb that is also 
द यूनिट फॉर पोटेंशियल डिफरेंस और पोटेंशियल सो देर आर टू यूनिट्स ऑलरेडी यू हर्ड वन इज अ नॉर्मल पोटेंशियल दैसा यूनिट ऑफ पोटेंशियल और पोटेंशियल डिफरेंस इज वोल्ट और इट कैन बी सेड एज जूल पर कुलम सो दिस इज वॉट इज वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट इंफॉर्मेश अबाउट पोटेंशियल बट वाई वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट दिस इज अ वेरी वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एस्पेक्ट ऑफ क्रिएटिंग और जनरेटिंग इलेक्ट्रिसिटी थ्रू फ्लो ऑफ चार्जेस ना इमेजिन इफ आई एम ब्रिंगिंग पॉजिटिव चार्ज टिल हियर आई टू डू वर्क इट्स ऑलमोस्ट लाइक दिस इज द ऑफिस एंड यू हैव ब्रोकन अ विंडो एंड द टीचर इज पुलिंग यू सो इज टू डू सम वर्क एंड ही लेफ्ट यू ओवर हियर यूल रन बैक बट देन वॉट हैपन्स यू गो क्लोजर टू द ऑफिस ही इज पुलिंग यू विद मोर एफर्ट एंड ही इज ब्रॉट यू टिल हियर नो ही इफ यू लिवस यू विल बी रनिंग फ्रॉम हियर टू दे फ्रॉम हियर टू there that means from b to a so same way if i leave the charge over here which is a positive charge it will travel from high potential to low potential provided it has a root it has a conductor it will run and provided we can create potential difference so it's very very important positive field of reference means high potential so negative field of reference will be low potential positive charges will flow from positive to negative that means from high potential to low potential and neg vice versa that means negative should flow, flow from low potential to high potential these are my new things you can understand suppose i rub something and i make a positive field over here you know in uh, you have studied rubbing something and making creating positive potential and creating negative potential both the bodies are joined through a, through a wire then you will get the electricity flow electrons to flow and that is what is electricity so this is the second video for you all with a lot of numerical potentials over here which you can do i will provide it i'll provide you some assignments so thanks